all, I wanted to share with you my miniature collection as far as my perfumes go. So I have them here. This is just one of those candle plates from the dollar store and then a candlestick from the dollar store that I glued to the plate. So it's nothing fancy. I have been looking for a cake plate, a glass, a nice porcelain one, but I haven't seen one that I liked in Marshalls. Also, I kind of have a lot of these on here. Usually the way I have them is I'll have them sitting. When they're on my dresser, I'll have some of them, especially the taller ones, are down on the table under my dresser. Not under my dresser. On the table. They're on the dresser underneath the cake plate. And I'll just have some up here and some will be down. I put them all on top to carry them in here um, where I'm filming. So I'm going to go through what I have and share it with you guys. Right now, what cannot fit on the plate are my Michael Kors. This is um, Michael Kors Gold Rose Edition. I have the regular Michael Kors fragrance right here. And then I also have Michael Kors White. I know it's fun to put my hand behind it. It doesn't really focus. I have Coach... It doesn't say it. I think this is Coach Poppy. I have Coach Poppy, Coach Poppy Wildflower, and Coach Poppy Blossom. This is Rihanna's fragrance, a uh, Rebel Fleur. I'm pretty sure that's what it is. This is Donna Karen. Oh, I can't think of the name of it now, but this is a Donna Karen fragrance. This is Donna Karen DKNY Be Delicious. DKNY Golden Delicious. See this little label in there. And these are all, most of these are not spray actually. You know, it's just the, um, you have to dab it, which I kind of don't like. I think Rihanna, nope, she's not to dab it. And these are ones you have to dab as well, the Michael Kors ones. Now, oddly enough, these Coach ones are all spray, as you can see. They're all spray ones. All those are spray ones. These are the Lolita Lampinka miniatures now I scored these the set that I'm about to show you was $39 forever at Bullet to Cold Factory finally I went there one day and it was marked down to 12 something maybe it was 14 something 14 something so I decided to get it so many people talk about her fragrances and the first person I ever heard mention her was Pinky Charm here on YouTube so to be able to try out a bunch of them I said okay $14 not bad and I love miniatures so this is um all, all masculine, this one. I honestly don't remember the names of all of them. But this is Lolita Lampinka. This one is a Lolita Lampinka. I really like this design with the apple. It has a bite taken out of it. This is a Lolita Lampinka. And this is the last Lolita Lampinka. Please forgive me for not knowing the names. This is Mariah Carey, and it is forever. And how gorgeous is that bottle? Love it. This is Taylor Smith's Wonderstruck. And again, more dabbers. Britney Spears Fantasy. And I love this. It's a perfect miniature, the full size bottle. This is Usher for Women that I got in a coffer that I haven't actually used yet, actually. This is another Donna Karen fragrance. If I have the name of this one. This is DKNY Women or Woman. This just says DKNY for women, this bottle. Not for women, just DKNY perfume. 
This is Women, or Woman, I don't know how it's pronounced, for this particular perfume. And it's a triangular bottle, which I kind of like. This is Elizabeth Taylor. Well, of course, the name's not on it. I don't remember which one it is. Now, these are both by The Gap. This is called Close. <laughs> this is called Near. The Gap has a lot of fragrances, surprisingly. These are both $2.99 in Marshalls. There's Britney Spears Radiance, a little mini that came with some lotion and some body wash, which is very cool. And I like that it has, it has a spray. This, oh my goodness, I've used this all up. This is Sophia Verga's fragrance. And now I'm on the search. When I got this, full-size bottles of this were everywhere. So, but I... Burlington Co. Factory has a lot of miniatures, and they have the miniatures you can pay $6.99 for, and their miniatures are the full-size bottles, like this. That's what I got Rihanna for, from. She was $6.99 at Burlington Co. Factory, and it's a miniature for the full-size bottle. Now, I didn't, of course, know if I was going to like it. I love this. I get compliments every time I wear it. It's a very soft, feminine, floral fra fragrance. Oh, my goodness. I need a full-size bottle of this. As you can see, it's almost all gone. But this is Sophia by Sophia Verga, and it's a spray. This is Britney Spears, not Britney Spears, Mariah Carey's Wonderful? No, the other was Wonderful. I don't remember what this one is. It's got the butterfly on the top. Oh, this is a very cute bottle, though, with the plunger in it. And this is Justin Bieber's fragrance. I will say one thing about Justin Bieber's fragrances. The bottles are always insanely gorgeous. I mean, the full-size bottle of this is ridiculous. As well as all of his bottles. All the bottles for all his fragrances. I'm not that crazy about the smell of this. But this bottle, just gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. All of his, I think, are gorgeous. He has one of the best designers for his actual bottles of fragrance of anybody. So that's my miniature collection. Like this Britney Spears one, the Sofia Verga one. Those would be the ones that I would keep on the actual dresser. And then all these smaller ones would go on top of this. The taller ones would all be on the dresser, like the Rihanna one, this Donna Karen one. They would all go flat on the dresser. Um, and I'm going to have to put these poppy ones they're just not gonna fit some of these Michael Kors ones can go up here and whoops and then Lolita Lampinka ones but Mariah Carey and Sofia Verga and Britney Spears Donna Karen and Rihanna <laughs> and all these poppy ones are gonna have to stay down on the table but that is my miniature collection so let me know in the comments if you have any of these and what you think of them a great place for coffrets is which is just when you have a bunch of miniatures in a box is Berlin great places are Burlington Co Factory TJ Maxx and Marshall now Nordstrom Rack oh my goodness they had a they had this other one that I wanted. It was the Gucci one. If it's still there when my birthday rolls around, I'm getting it. It was all the floral um, fragrances together. They had a ton of different coffers. I was surprised. I hadn't been in there in a while. But definitely, absolutely, Burlington Co. Factory, Marshalls, and TJ Maxx for coffers. There was a Terry Mugler coffer in there for like 30 bucks that was supposed to be $60 and there's just you will always find some discounted fragrances in there so head there if you're really looking for something thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys later bye